Hey guys, OzGrills here. Today we're going to show you how to use Streamlabs Chatbot and give yourself a custom bot name. Alright guys, here we are. So we're back in our Streamlabs tutorial editor. Alright, so what we want to do here is we want to download the chatbot. So we'll go, obviously, easy Google search, just type in Streamlabs Chatbot. My computer is very slow, so this could take some time. Alright, so there we go. Create your own chatbot using a custom name. So easy. Download now. Easy as that. The next thing you want to do while you're waiting for the download is go to twitch.tv. So hopefully by now you've thought of what custom name you want your bot to be. Um, and what you're going to do now is you're going to create a new account with the name. So say my one is OzGrillBot, um, which I'm open for <laughs> different names as well if we want. So just create yourself a new account in Twitch with your bot's name, simple as that. All right, so now we got ready, Streamlabs chatbot has been downloaded and we are going to open it. All right, so mine's all connected here, but yours won't be obviously. So all you have to do is go here or say log in as your bot. So it'll come up with the Twitch login screen here you just type in the name your new accounts name and your password hit ok it'll ask for permissions uh, just accept those permissions once you're logged in there it'll come up login as your streamer channel so then you type in your streamer details and your password and you're there done so easy so then it makes him a moderator obviously so we've got Oz, the moderators of the channel here and you've got Oz Grillbot as a moderator so he can post commands do everything so setting up some stuff in here I don't have a lot set up but you can do like song requests you can put on uh, it's only YouTube now it used to be YouTube and Spotify so people can if it's enabled do exclamation mark SR space and then put a YouTube link um, you can change the settings as well so they have to have a minimum amount of points if you're doing that or they have to be like a moderator or they can be, you know, a regular, a subscriber. You can change the different, different permissions here, all the cost of them. So you've got like max requests. So if you're a viewer, you've got two regular, two subs have a thousand, etc. So you can set that up. Another one that I have here is commands. So I've got a few commands here, like 24 hour, which isn't enabled at the moment. You can enable dis or disable them as well. Um, or you do like charity, discord, follow, followers, hosting, you know, all kinds of stuff there for commands. We can do timers as well, which most of mine are disabled, but you can do whatever. So you can have like, would you like to join Osgirls discord? Got the settings for that. And it's got every 15 minutes, there has to be a minimum chat line of four. So four people have to be chatting. So that means if no one's chatting in your chat, you're not just going to get the same message every 15 minutes. So you're going to have to have some chatters in there for them to show up. Unless you put zero, it's up to you. Um, another thing you can do is like use currency and it'll give points. You can play mini games as well. So you can do like highest, dual, free for all. They're all different games which you can just have fun playing around with. I don't have any set up. I don't need the... You, know, you don't want that spam in your chat unless you know some people do so you can do that there as well and there's heaps of different things you can do really so i just have mine set up very simply so you just got some commands and some timed messages i have the currency set up but we don't use it in the song request currency is a good way to check of who's actually been in your channel as well if you're looking for to reward people as well it's quite good for that so yeah that is how you set up streamlabs chatbot um, with your own custom bot name and yeah it's quite an easy setup so thank you guys thanks guys for coming to the video as you know i'm on twitch twitch.tv forward slash i stream most days from 8 p.m to midnight australian time and weekends varies but generally i'm on the weekends as well uh, if you could like this video 
and subscribe to this channel would be very much appreciated. I'm going to put out a lot more content regarding Streamlabs. Just getting started really. I've only been doing this for a month as you can probably tell by some of the video quality. Hey guys, thanks heaps for watching guys. I uh, really appreciate it and I'll see you next time. Where the hell are they? I thought he'd come from over here, the sound.